It's referred to as Jamaica's second city and it's one of the island's top tourism destinations. Montego Bay St. James with its vibrant hip strip, white sandy beaches and captivating resort life that continues to beckon to persons outside the region is a beautiful place. But even more beautiful are some of the hidden treasures in the parish. In today's Round of Bend, we experience some of the most authentic and fulfilling experiences you can imagine. Walk with me. After treading the rocky riverbed of the Montego River, following the footpath on its bank, you will be escorted to a hidden gem, the Rastafari Indigenous Village. This 10-year-old village, which is tucked away in Portobello, Montego Bay, was established by a group of Rastafarians who have come together to preserve their culture and introduce visitors to their way of life and teachings. Our philosophy is one of harmony, mm -hmm. and music shows you clearly that difference is not something that can stop you from being harmonious. Why? Because everyone plays a different beat, everyone makes a different sound, but still it comes together to make one music. And that's the message of Rastafari, that even though we are from different places, different skin tone, different eye colors, we can celebrate these differences instead of allowing them to separate us so we can create one beautiful song for the human experience and the planet. During this time, visitors are served fresh fruits in bamboo and they can also get a chance to learn the art of traditional drumming. After relishing the pulsating tunes of the drums, visitors are then escorted to the various stations in the village where they will be further immersed in the Rastafari culture. You eat from a calabash crew, you like you're a little pepped mm. up, you know? Mm. <laughs> we use a combination of seeds and stones, coconut shells, to make all these um, jewelry. But this is where you, know, you get a chance to, you know, get something natural for yourself, family and friends. If you want to make anything, we, like earrings, we have the sticks. You put the beads on and we put the hook on for you. If you see anything that you want to get, then it's there, you know. No charge for touching, only if you hold it too long. This is what I do. I may drum, but this is something if you don't love it, you're not going to do it. Yeah, because you see what I was just doing? Just dig it. Just dig it. But you cannot afford to make no mistake. This fell apart, but this drop on your finger. You know what it's like. <coughs> Some of my fingers, they are not straight. They are broken bones, cracked bones, and I lose my nails sometimes. But because I love what I do, pain is to me like nothing. So this is where we make natural soaps with the material around us and coconut oil is the main oil in this process. We put the coconut oil with sodium hydroxide dissolving water and that's the basic soap formula. Different measurements are used. We incorporate um, some soaps, fragrance oils, essential oils as well. You can open and you can smell. We do not use water in our juices. We only use sugar cane in our juices, yeah? You know what this is? Ginger. Ginger. So in all of our juices, we have sugar cane and ginger. If you call Rastafari a coconut movement, you'll be correct because we use coconut to do every single thing. So, I'm going to take you to coconut heaven. On the back of your hands, I'm going to give you a drop mm -hmm. of coconut love. Yeah, man. Mm. So this is extra virgin coconut oil. Mm. We use this on everything that we have, our salads. Yes, 
We use coconut. The Rastafara village is definitely not an all-inclusive resort, but persons can visit the wellness center for a moment of relaxation or stay overnight in one of the numerous cabins on location. There's also an organic vegetable and herb garden you can explore. But if after the tour you still crave even more one-on-one -on -one experiences of the Rastafarian way of life, then the monthly Aritz concert is all you need. And these live for the plants to be free and we build our own society. Um, we started Aritz in January 2018. And, you know, as a group of, of Rastafari people who are here, we had always been planning, you know, to say that we must see how culture can cure. A lot of the musicians from Montego Bay, they always have to migrate to go somewhere else. And there are just so much traditions that are dying. And along with all of these things that are dying, we think that we could facilitate them under one umbrella. So Iritz became that umbrella of wellness. It became that umbrella for food and it became a space where music and, 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 and of course everything else to do with culture. The event, which is held on the last Sunday of each month at one o'clock, never fails to bring out some of the best talents you can find. There in the cover of the darkness you watch and wait You know exactly what to say Cause you've been caught before I tell you If you're looking for the perfect opportunity to learn about the Rastafari community, indulge in its way of life and become one with their culture, you know where to go.